First off, Merry Christmas to all you people out there on YouTube. And thank you for looking at my videos. This video is a video request that I got a few days ago from this person. Um, can't really pronounce their name on here, but they had some questions for me that they wanted me to answer, so this is an answer to their questions. Um, this video will be about, you know, about how I identify with being Ethiopian and what it means. Uh, you know, in regards to your first question, um, I identify as an Ethiopian American. I don't identify as African American. Why? Because it's just different culture, different aspects, different race overall. I and mean, a lot of people argue the issue and say, you know, Ethiopian and African American is the same. No, it's not. The culture is completely different, different music, different looks, different features. Only similarities would be that of color, but even other African races like Zimbabwe people, South of Africans, people from Chad, Morocco, Egypt, they're not African American. So to answer your question, no. I disagree with Ethiopians being African Americans. They're Ethiopian Americans. In regards to your second question, which I'm reading right here, man, African Americans, they do look at me differently. And I do not get accepted by them. Why? Because the culture is different. They don't know what I am and they can't identify with what I am. They think that I'm either Indian or Hispanic or of some other race of some kind. But they have no idea what I am when they look at me. I don't know if that helps answer your question, but I don't know, but that's the truth. I never was able to be accepted by them. I always had problems with them. I never got along with them, you know. It was a very difficult being around them my whole life. I got teased, made fun of, beat up. And lastly, Ethiopians don't have a problem at all. They just, uh, they're just their own people. I mean, I know you said you're half Somali, half Ethiopian, from this letter you sent me. And, um, and overall, you know, it's just, you just gotta treat people like people. It doesn't really matter, I mean, I don't know, I know you said you're writing a book, or you're writing a report or something, so... You already should know that a lot of Ethiopian people are very racist. They don't like African Americans. A good majority, anyway. Especially the older generation. Like your parents. Or grandparents. It's just not the same culture. you got to realize, Ethiopians were never slaves. They never got colonized like other African races got colonized. Ethiopia never did. But it's a proven fact. Which, uh... You can look up yourself if you don't believe me. And lastly, you want to know if I was a uh, raised by a single mother. That's your question? Yes, I was. I never had a father. My father was an extreme asshole. I never even paid child support. He's a piece of shit rapist. Who put me in the bed with his fat 400 pound girlfriend. So I hope that answers your question, man. Uh, Merry Christmas. Good luck with your report. Peace.